डियर फ्रेंड्स 363 हंड्रेड डेज ऑफ वोर यस्टरडे बाइडेन विजिटेड कीएफ मेट जेलेंस्की एंड प्रॉमिस्ड लॉट्स ऑफ एंड लॉट्स ऑफ वेपन्स फिनेंस कैपिटल एंड अदर थिंग्स फॉलोड बाय मैसिव प्रोपेगेंडा इन मीडिया एंड एल्सवेयर बाय द वेस्टर्न कंट्रोल्ड मीडिया बट वन थिंग विच आई वॉन्टेड टू टेल यू इज दैट जस्ट shortly before landing the us officials contacted russian federation officials and told them what is biden's so called sudden and secret program to avoid conflict situation reported by associated press this is what this top parasitic leaders do today to safeguard themselves first and let the working class and the soldiers die in north the ukrainian forces continue intense firing in kursk and belgorod regions they have hit many power infrastructure and even some civilian establishments while in kupians to liman direction heavy artillery duels and positional battle continues except few offensive by the russians who are slowly moving on swatov krimina line and the ground assaults northwest of northwest of swatov towards kupians direction continues in south all along the battle line the artillery duel continues in southeast Vuhledar more PMC wagonart troops are being pumped in while there is an information that Ukrainian forces regain almost all positions lost in previous Russian army offensive it was in any case as they claim that it was difficult to hold outskirts of the city as Russians failed to enter the city there is also informations that Russian forces are continuing their offensive from the south in towards ugledar and the above informations which i give is false marinka fierce fight is on in odivka the ukrainian counter offensive forced the russians to stop their offensive and positional battle is on in the outskirts however the russians are said to have controlled many heights in northern part of avdivka coming to bakhmut front pmc wagner has controlled smog inspection station and moving towards stupchi rather might have controlled the latter part in barkhivka the pmc pmc offensive is on though it still remains under the control of ukrainian army isw reports that the russian forces have incremental gains in an outside Bakhmut front in Chasiv Yar Ivanisk line also they have moved forward which is in southwest Yagodny the Russian and allied forces have captured it and also they have taken over Sput Stupki railway station and moving towards Jabuk Jabuk Mukta Torsky some marginal gains and siversk status quo remains that is in short situation of the battleground stoltenberg says that putin is not planning for peace but planning for more war okay he may be right in the meantime there is calculated information that nato transferred ukraine close to 1200 air defense system 440 tanks 1500 plus infantry vehicles and 665 artillery system since december 2021 even before the war and nato is not participating in the war war well that's the end from my side for the day